Um, uh, so the uh, mayoral election that recently happened. Oh, we, we don't have that much time here. Okay, good. We have some. Yeah, we're cool, Kev. Okay. We. Uh, how much is too much to spend on a campaign? Like, oh. if, if you were in politics, <laughs> would you be, like, throwing all the money at the advertising? Or, like, let's save it for a rainy day in the election. Like, how would Meredith Shaw handle an election? No, we'd go, we'd go big. I'd have to. I'd have to get the votes. <laughs> get the I vote? mean, yeah. I'd have to politics do the same thing. is not the career I'm, I'm headed for. So I, I feel like I'd go big up front. You know, I'd, okay. I'd get the advertising out there. Yeah, and yeah, hope for the best. I'm with you. So remember Zhao Wa Gong, I do. who had all the signs all over town So here? many signs. You Forever. could not drive yeah. 50 feet <laughs> and not see one of his Toronto mayoral election signs. Yes. So we now know how much he spent on all this, because that was the ongoing discussion here in the studio and basically the entire city. So candidate Gong spent $700,000 total. Wow. Total. Oh, okay. in the campaign. Yes. Okay. Yes. Four hundred thousand in advertising. The signs alone were one hundred and twenty three G's. OK, now he finished 11th in the polls. So I don't know if that's a success or a failure for candidate uh, Zhao Wao Gong. But, but he's kind of coming out of nowhere, right? Completely so out of nowhere. So to be 11th, yes. uh, you know, I mean, that's a... So that's a, that's a thumbs up? I, I guess. <laughs> I just remember him not being able to take the signs down at the end. So you got to save a little bit of the budget. If you're going to go deep on putting up the signs, you got to save some budget to take I read it, it down. It also cost 123000 to take the signs down. Yeah. There were that many it. signs. Mm -hmm, were. Anna Bailao outspent Olivia Chow, still lost. These are some of the other numbers. Finally, the winner of the No Bang for Their Buck award mm. is to counselor Josh Matlow, who spent more than what his campaign brought in and is 150000 in deficit oh. after not becoming mayor of Toronto. That's a kick in the teeth. That's tough. That's a kick in the teeth. Not to get it and then to owe. Yeah, right. You know, to owe money. That's, yes. Yeah, that, that's a bit tough. You lose, now give me, it's like Game of Monopoly. You yeah. lose, <laughs> now give me all the funds. But I the, like that we get to know that breakdown, though. I find it quite interesting. I think it's fair. To see who spent what. And it's interesting that, uh, you know, even though she was outspent, Olivia Chow still uh, took, the, Great took campaign. the top spot. Because, you know, good campaign, good substance. Yeah. yeah. And for Canada Gone, listen, I saw the sign. It's 701. You're watching BT.